Hi guys, welcome to my new channel. Um, I hope you guys are all doing really, really well at home. Day one of no school. Some of you are jumping for joy. Others have probably had a bit of a boring day. First of all, I just want to say that I miss you all 100%. It's been the strangest day, waking up on a Monday, not coming into the classroom, not setting up, not seeing your faces, all smiling and happy. So I will really, really miss you and I hope you guys are all staying well, looking after your grown-ups at home, and I hope that you find this really, really useful. Obviously, I am very new to this. The cut. Cut! And hopefully it all works. And as we keep working through this period, hopefully this can be something that we use more and more and more. Um, I'd like to start off by saying thank you all for doing your bit. So amazing to see that already so many of you are trying to get online and do stuff. Uh, you may or may not know, but DB Primary actually crashed this morning. Nobody could get on it nationwide, so well done there for all being enthusiastic. I do apologize, that is my baby. We will be away from school for a good chunk of time. Please be patient, please be kind, please look out for each other and we'll all help each other get through this. Stay at home, stay well, and let's take it from there, shall we? Right, so I bet most of you have set up your classrooms, your home from home classrooms, but I would just stress, let's not rush this period. Let's take our time, let's make sure everything works. I'm really happy to see that people are already using DB Primary. Any work or anything that you want to send in, please, please send that across. Have a play with all the other things that we've sent you, Classroom Secret, Rockstar Maths. Uh, I thought I would give you a little tour of my home from home classroom. And maybe you can send me a picture of how your classroom looks. So as you can see, we've got the guitar. This is my desk at the moment. Now a classroom teacher desk. I also share it with a seven month old baby. Hence why I have a ball pit and a jumperoo. Not So that's my classroom. It would be amazing to see what some of your classrooms look like, what some of your routines are, what things you've done already. So just a short episode today. However, I will leave you with this. I want to set a number challenge. I'm gonna write you a number, I'm gonna tell you the number, and you are going to tell me all the things that you know about that number. The number I would like us to do is 36. So hopefully you can all see mine. 36 I've got in the middle. I'm gonna do a nice bubble around it. Some things that you guys could tell me, put your hands up. Oh yeah, that's right, we're at home. So 36 I've got here, things that I could say about 36. Well, I might be able to do a place value chart. 36 only has tens and ones. I might be able to do a part hole, about 36. Lots of different variations of part hole. I might be able to do a times table. I might be able to write a story about the number 36, a mathematical story, of course. Those are just some examples. Fill the whole page, show me absolutely everything you know about 36. That's me out for today. Please let me know if it's good, if it's helpful, we'll do more stuff like this. So bye for now. Homeschool on me, homeschool on free. One, two, three, homeschool. Nice one, guys.